Hey everyone, Laura here and welcome back to my channel. So today I got my, well I guess I didn't get it today, I got it like a couple days ago. I got my Sephora Play. I just like love getting mail. Anybody else just love getting mail? I just like freaking love it. Every time I get a package, I'm just like the happiest girl. I'm like, yes, I got a package today, it's so exciting, I can't wait, la la la. Yeah, that's how I am. So if you want to see what I got in my Sephora Play for the month of February, then stick around. So for any of you who don't know what Sephora Play is, it's basically a subscription box, but it's given to you by Sephora. And what's really cool about it is basically all the products you can get at Sephora.com or in the store. So if there's something like you really love, you can just go to the store and buy it, which is awesome because... Some of the su subscription boxes have a hard time finding the product, and if I find it, it's usually not the right one, or whatever. It's super annoying. But I really love Sephora Play because I could just get what I want at the store. So you get this little card in the box. Um, you get some, like, bonus points when you shop. Woohoo, I love bonus points. Um, and it gives you, like, this whole breakdown isn't that so cool? You get like this whole breakdown of everything that comes in your box, like um, how to use it, a tip on how to use it. So it's super stinking cool. I love it. And online you can get like a sneak peek as to what it's gonna be. And this one was lips, so I was super excited. And I'm not gonna lie, I've already tried some of those stuff. I know. Okay, anyway. So this month came in this cute little bag. Isn't this so sinking cute? Cute little bag. Open it up and all the goodies are inside. What's better than that, honestly? So I was really excited it was lips because I am trying to branch out in my lip, lippy, I, lippy stuff, you know? So I was really excited and I got in mine the Too Faced Lip Injection Gloss. So I've always wanted to try this. I'm a huge Too Faced fan. Um, I love all of their stuff. I have so many other products, foundation, shadows, liquid lip, like I love their stuff. Um, so I was really excited to try this. So I couldn't wait and I just tried it. And at first I was like, oh my God, my mouth, oh, what's going on? Why does it feel like this? And then I was like, okay, lip injection, so it probably is like a plumper almost. So I tried this, and for like a good maybe five minutes, my lips were like do, 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 throbbing a little bit. But um, I really liked the result. So once you get over that whole shock of the injection, it sort of slowed down. So it wasn't as bad. So um, it's awesome. Will I buy a full-size one? I'm not sure yet. I'm going to have to use this more. Um, and I really like the shade, the color of this one. Okay, it's the only thing I really tried. It's just like a nice peachy color. Clear peach. It's perfect for every day. Um, and I could definitely use a little more lip help. Let's put some of this on. And what I love about it is it's not sticky. I hate when lip glosses are sticky. I'm not a lip gloss person, like, to begin with. And, like, to make a lip gloss sticky, it just kind of makes me even more mad. Okay? So that's the first product. The second lip product I am so excited I got. Because I watched a couple other Sephora Play videos. And some people got a tart lip. And some people got the NARS lip. And I was praying to the makeup gods I got the NARS Velvet Lip Glide. And... Bam, I did. I have wanted to try this so freaking bad. I just like could not bring myself to just buy one because you're paying for NARS price. Um, you know what I mean? So I got the color Bound and let's see what it says about these babies. So it's a dusty rose color, which I agree. It's a velvety liquid formula, which is infused with natural oils. So it glides on effortlessly effortlessly and feels weightless super cool um it's also semi matte so i'm assuming it doesn't dry to a full matte like a liquid lip would so yes what a perfect mauve oh my gosh i'm so excited to try this i can't believe i didn't try it first i truly was super excited about that gloss the injection one because i was like two face i love two face 
but look at that color. That is a perfect everyday color. I am super excited to try this. Super excited. I've seen so many good things about them, so how could it, how can you go wrong? I mean, how can you go wrong? It would be like, it's actually my first NARS product. Oh my gosh, I'm branching out. Yeah, I don't own anything by NARS, so I'm excited. And I'm excited I just had to pay $10 for the subscription box to try the NARS, you know what I mean? This Clinique Pep Start Moisturizer. So let's see what it says about that baby. I should have this ready. Um, it's a lightweight, oil-free moisturizer, meets primer instantly, blurs imperfections while providing an all-day hydration for a silky, soft, focused finish. Okay, you had me at hydrating, honestly. Um, I've actually been really into Skin Drink from Lush. I've been really using that, and my skin has just been looking so much more hydrated. Like, this weather is kicking my face's butt. Okay, I've been so dry. It's so flipping annoying. Um, but I did buy from Clinique the Take the Day Off, that, like, uh, gel balm to remove your makeup. Oh, I can feel my lips now. Um, so I am excited to try, try something else from Clinique. I'm always looking to try some more, I guess, high-end skincare because I've come to the realization I am 27 years old and not getting any younger, and neither is my skin. So, yeah, that's that realization, okay? Fourth product, oh my gosh, is Origins Refreshing Eye Cream. Ooh, yeah. So again, another product I use for my eyes right now is from Lush. It's the Enchanted Eye Cream. And I just put it underneath my eyes a very little bit and just kind of all around. And I really noticed a lift with that stuff. So I'm excited to just try something else for my eyes and see if that works. I'm not opposed to trying this in my routine. I've never tried anything by Origin, so we'll see how this goes. Product I got is the Sephora Lash Craft Length and Volume Mascara. Ooh, okay. Okay, mascara. It's all in a different language, so let's not read that. So this mascara uh, is a jet black volumizing mascara with an innovative flat paddle shaped wand to lengthen and lift lashes. All right, that's that sounds like some big stuff. We'll have to, I'm definitely gonna have to try that. Definitely going to have to try. Um, I'm always down to try new mascaras. I actually use one from Unique. It's an independent makeup company. So social media based kind of thing. Um, and I really like that. I always get length, I get volume, I get like lashes that look like this. So I'm okay. Let's try. I'm, I'm willing to try. Uh, you know what? What, is, what can it hurt? It doesn't. I'm trying it out. Um, I do really like the Sephora Collection Liquid Liner, which is this one. It's the 24-hour felt liner. I really like this by them. So, I mean, why not try the mascara? What's the worst that can happen? I don't like it, and then I take it off, right? You know what I mean? You know what I mean? And then last but not least is, I think they always do this. I'm not really sure. I think you always get a perfume, but this is the Marc Jacobs Define Decadence. Can't really smell it. Oh my god, but look how stinking cute that full size probably is. Oh my gosh, I hope that's the full size package. Because that little purse is adorable. I should not have put that lip gloss on my hand because now I'm feeling it. Ooh, this is super florally. Very I think it's very florally. Let's see. Florally. Oh my gosh, I'm having like the worst time talking today. Let's see what it says. Yes, floral and bright. I agree. It is floral. It is bright. Um, champagne doused scent. Yes. Top note is champagne extract orange blossom. Middle note is gardenia, hydrania, honeysuckle. And the base note is amber and vanilla. Um, not, this, this scent is not my cup of tea. This is not something I would buy, something I would wear often at all. I, I don't, it's not a scent for me. I'm more of a musty sort of scent person. So that's just what I like, you know? 
So to recap my Sephora Play Box, I got the Too Faced Lip Injection Glossy Gloss Gloss. Super excited. I have it on my lips right now and I'm feeling a little woo-woo-woo. Um, I got the NARS Velvet Lip Glide in the color Bound. Yes. I'm so, I think this is the thing I'm most excited about. Um, Clinique Pep Start Hydrating Moisturizer. Super cool. I am all about adding something new and trying something new to my skincare. Um, I already have a Clinique product, like I said, so I know it'll be okay on my skin, or I hope it'll be okay on my skin. Um, Origins Refreshing Eye Cream. Maybe I'll mix this with the eye cream I already use, right? What's the worst that can happen? Like, more eye cream, the better? I think so. And then I got the Sephora brand Lash Craft Volumizing Mascara. Always down to dry new mascara, yes. And then last but not least, the Marc Jacobs Divine Decadence Perfume Sample. Super cool. Um, I'm really happy with this month. I really love getting these um, subscription boxes. I'm such a sucker for a subscription box. I don't know about anybody else, but that's just me, you know? It is what it is. So I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Um, if you're not subscribed to Sephora Play, like, definitely get on their website and subscribe. I know there's usually a waiting list, but it's so cool because you could just go into the store and get the product you want without having to search and go crazy for it. So that's what I really love about it. Um, and you get it every month. It's 10 bucks, and you get legitimately really good brands. So it's super awesome. You know, why not, right? So if you like this video, then give it a thumbs up. If you liked me even more, then make sure you hit subscribe and subscribe to my channel. And I hope you guys have a stellar day. Bye.